doors have always been very symbolic for me. A lot of people don't see doors to opportunity. I want to open doors for other people now. I figure that's, that is what I should be doing. She shows us that not only is there a silver lining to being different, it's the source of genius. Sometimes it does come at the cost of not having more of a quote-unquote social or private life, but Temple's commitment to her work and to people, to teaching people and to helping animals, she has the fullest life of anybody I know. Like I'll listen to country western music in my car and 60% of the songs are about relationships. I'd rather listen to the trucking songs. I kind of relate to those better. <laughs> When I first started out, there were no women out working with the animals. Now there's lots of them. There's no question in my mind that she's a pioneer. And started out as this gawky kid. It's been really fun to see her young fun side come out again. Here in the West, in the middle of the West, Bonanza. Oh, man. See, but that's pure visual thinking. And there's kind of a hill still there. That's where we go sledding. Well, if a person th totally thought in words, they might have a hard time imagining a dog was conscious, but yeah. always seemed to me a dog was conscious. I've got to always be on my best behavior because a lot of kids look up to me and I want to inspire them. I realize how lucky I am to work with Temple Grandin. I'm really lucky. We go this place. When I was younger, I used to look for like great, mysterious meanings of life. And when I've gotten older, I've thought the most important things are the things that I do help do something real to make something better. Temple just is one of those people who feels that her existence on earth depends upon her making contributions to others. And I truly believe that God gave her a gift that she feels she must share. Funny.